bringing y'all today the Barclay Posit Max. In my opinion, out of all the All Star shoes, Area 72 shoes, this was one of two that I felt I had to get. As you can see, I believe all the Area 72 uh, collection come with this newspaper. Nice touch by Nike. Real nice touch. But um, between this Barclay Posit Max and the Air Force Max, that's my number one out of both of these. I, I had to have, and I will have those hopefully tomorrow. Uh, I'm not going to beat y'all over the head with this review. I mean, there's, there's plenty of them on YouTube. I just want to point out some of the details of this shoe. As you can see right off, that 3M popping all through this upper. Very nice. Uh, the texture on here too. Uh, you really have to hold this in hand to really appreciate the level of detail that Nike did. What they put into this shoe. Like when I touched this midsole, uh, I was watching a video. Somebody said it, it felt like uh, asphalt. And that's an exact... Uh, you know exactly what they mean. It, it it feels like asphalt. I mean, there's a texture on here, kind of makes it feel like it's rock. And uh, on the upper, you know, it gives that something like a meteorite effect throughout the shoe. And then you got the speckle on here there on the air unit. You got your glow in the dark sole. Then on the bottom. It says not a roll and then on the left shoe it says model featuring that glow in the dark sole comes with this uh, this tag just like uh, last year's galaxy phone posit this one obviously you can see is 3m CWB 1963 Charles Wade Barkley I will tell you, when I put this on foot, this is a boot. I mean, I'm going to be real with y'all. This is a this shoe is is a boot. I mean, I'm used to wearing, you know, the Jordans or, or Kobe 8s. I got them on my feet right now. But uh, this shoe is, is huge. I mean, man. And the foam positive material on it, you know, it's... It seems softer than the normal foam posit. I can push on it and it flexes more. So I'm trying to understand a justification for that $250. I mean, the detail, obviously, you can see inside. You know, a lot of detail that went into it. But for the regular release, I think it's, what, $235? And I just don't see where they're getting that price from. Uh, but you can see on the, the tongues, you got your your ray gun character on both tongues. One of the first things that hit me when I opened up this shoe box, I don't know if it's the paper, the box, the shoes, you are hit with this smell. I don't know if anyone has this, this shoe or maybe the collection. Man, it's the glue or something. It, it just knocks you out. I had to air these shoes out in my basement. I mean, that's how strong the smell is. But, you know, let me know if, if yours is like that. I, can, I just couldn't believe the, the smell that went into these shoes. I did try these on. I mean, they are comfortable. Don't get me wrong. Even though I, I classify it as a boot. I mean, it's a real comfortable shoe. I'm glad to have it in the collection. Like I said, I have the Air Max Force hopefully tomorrow. I spent yesterday chasing down raffles for the corks. So far, I had a pretty good run of getting shoes. Hopefully, I'm able to get those. Um, I can bring y'all a review either Saturday if I get them or next week. I know with these, the one thing I do want to touch on, you know, last week when I got these, I got these from Nike Store. And, you know, a lot of people, I'll hear them talk about how they aren't able to get releases. Well, 
I got this pair 15 minutes after they dropped on Nike store. And that's the one thing I can tell you is even if you don't get it right away, man, keep trying. Because, you know, like I said, I got these 15 minutes after. These these Kobe 8 Christmases, I got these 40 minutes after they dropped. You know, you're going to have people who make mistakes and they get them booted out of car that they take too long checking out. Man, keep trying to add the cart. I mean, it's, it's uh, you know, if you really want that shoe, you'll have it. And that's my intentions. When I go in getting the shoe, I'm not going to stop until I get that, that tweet that says all sold out. Um, another tip I can give you is, you know, make sure you have a, a, a good, well, I say pretty fast internet connection. And, you know, if you're on Wi-Fi, Man, if you can, try to do direct connection. Obviously, you're going to get a lot faster speed that way. Um, and, and stay persistent. I mean, that's all I can tell y'all. But um, I'm glad to have this pair. Um, I do want to uh, recognize all the the uh, subscribers that I've picked up recently. I mean, just from you know folks that I've been watching, some of the big YouTubers. I salute you guys and some of everyone else. Anybody who's who's been watching my videos and who's been uh, subscribing, I appreciate it. You know, as I uh, you know get more involved in doing more videos, I have a new camera. I'm I'm looking at trying to get, um, trying to do some more things, add a little bit more detail, you know, to these reviews. So I want to just thank everybody for uh, you know looking out for your boy, checking this video out, and you know keep subscribing. You know, hopefully uh, down the road you'll get a face-to-face -face with me and I'll be able to do more, you know, interactive videos with you guys. But uh, I just wanted to show y'all one of two. Hopefully tomorrow I have my uh, Air Max 2013s, the Ray Gun Edition, Area 72. But for now, Barkley Posits, out. Peace.